I actually did that the other night. I was playing Tarkov with Aethel and I had Supermarket Simulator open in another window. So in between like... During like downtime, I would go to my store and just like stock sh <laughs> and tab back in the Tarkov. <laughs> and it got my wires crisscrossed because like I would go into Tarkov and be like, Oh sh I gotta stock more crackers on this shelf right here. And then I'd go in the supermarket simulator going like up and down the aisles thinking like, Oh f is there a scav over there? Oh f Oh sh Is that a scav or a PMC? Get down! Get down! But it was just like a customer trying to buy some bread. And then I shot them in the head and killed them. It took a while to clean up all the, the blood splatter, but... <laughs> yeah, I'm known as kind of a badass. Oh god, don't look! Spoiler, spoiler, spoiler! Okay, before we do our Elden Ring gaming today... Just a little bit of Supermarket Simulator as a treat. <laughs> I'm kind of a hardcore bad butt. I'm known in these pods as kind of an intimidating hardcore bad butt. Uh... Gaming legend. This is my supermarket. And I have some storage. It looks like a huge mess right now. Don't mind, don't mind. I think I might have to stock some toilet paper. Let's see, let's see. Oh yes, I do. Oh, that looks like shit. Okay, so... This looks kind of weird right now, I admit. But I don't know, what do you guys think of the... The checkout counter... Orientation. I used to have them over here, but I was running out of room. Like, I wanted to have two checkouts, but there's no room for, like, people to line up. Can you get a bigger store? I can. I'm actually gonna do that right now. And I'm gonna restock some of my sh**. Because I'm low on Frenchy fries. And let's see here. Toilet paper. Window cleaner. Oh gosh, they cleaned me out last night. They ransacked the place. Damn! They just came in here and uh, fucked all the shelves. They left no shelf on. Welcome to Myanmar. Yes. You can fuck the shelves. You can fuck every loaf of bread. Just make sure you put it back when you're done. Oh, here's some more yogurt. And I know there's like boxes of shit right here that I could put in storage, but I'm too lazy to do it. It's part of the uh, experience. You walk into the store and you know it's like a laid back, casual atmosphere. Because there's like a bunch of shit in boxes in the corner. Maybe a few stains on the floor, a few stains on the bread over here. Maybe there's like uh, some holes cut out of the bread. And like, you open up the jar of peanut butter and it's clearly been opened and there's like a strange uh, crevice in the middle of it. It just has that laid back atmosphere where you can feel like you're not just at a supermarket, you're at home. And you don't have to take your shoes off, but you can if you want. This is a, a no shoes friendly store. And we never clean the floors in here. So everyone's footprints are just like scattered around. If you took a black light to this baby, it'd look like the the Milky Way galaxy. It'd look amazing. That's actually what we do sometimes. We have uh you know they have glow in the dark bowling at bowling alleys? We have glow in the dark shopping nights. We we turn off the lights and just turn on black lights and you can see all the like the white splatters everywhere that guide your way. Anyway. Let's see. I gotta restock my honey, my peanut butter, and my rice. Half the customer is glowing in the dark. Yeah, there's a lady that comes in that always has uh, her face is glowing. It's amazing. She just lights up the room. She just has a beautiful smile, I guess. Why is there a hole in the peanut butter? It's not a bug, it's a feature. Oh god, did I drink my gamer subs before the time? Oh, did, did, I don't, well. oh no, I'm good. Sorry, I have to make sure I don't drink my gamer subs until a certain time because it has citric acid in it and it interacts with the my my schizophrenia medication and it'll make it not as effective. Are you sponsored, by the way? By gamer subs? Yes. By schizophrenia medication? No. 
Unfortunately not. Okay, just gonna stock. Oh, wait, what was here? I think I had some cheese. Some cheese over there. Here's some more honeys. Mmm, honey! Look how much money we made, too. $2,500, pretty much. That's some good prog. It's good prog right there. And some more peanut butter. My penis weenus, of course. I put peanut butter on my penis weenus. Wait, is this box empty? What were they thinking? Okay, here's some efok. Gotta stock that efok back up. Efok from Ebombs World. You two poop. Where there's smoke, they pinch back. Okay, put the spaghetti right there. You know what I hope they add to this game? I hope they add like a notepad that you can pull up in game and just click on individual shelves that have like less items on them or no items and you can just like click and it'll like, automatically add to the notepad like here's what you need to buy and you can take the notepad with you to your little computer station over here click on the market and just have the note like open in the corner like where i am right now where my big fat stupid hat it is that would be so nice because the way i'm doing it right now <laughs> i either have to like open up a notepad on my computer and type what i need to buy or i need to remember it and i'm not gonna fucking remember it oh god Ugh, morning flip <laughs> holy fuck i just coughed up like eight hours worth of phlegm nice i got a clock in my eye yeah sorry i got hairballs in the morning i think maybe i should just bite the bullet and get a fucking humidifier for my room eh? so i stopped coughing all over you guys in the morning it's so annoying i've been loving morning streams for sure it's been so fucking chill but i will say it is annoying as fuck that for the first hour i have morning phlegm my voice is so scratchy when i wake up dude and i have to like clear my throat every other sentence and then as i hydrate and wake up it goes away but it makes it so difficult to talk and i just feel i don't know i get self-conscious i feel like i i don't know i feel like i'm transforming into something Something out of this world. Okay, I need orange juice, apple juice. Mmm. Orange juice, apple juice, Fortnite cola, water. Can you guys remember? I'm not a mouth breather, actually. I don't even really snore when I sleep. I think it's just, it's really dry. And I'm allergic to everything. There's a lot of pollen in the air. Maybe that's part of it. Ugh. Here, let me chug some gamer slips. Maybe that'll help. <sighs> is Ethel younger than Nyan? No, he is older than me by a year. Why are you... <laughs> what is that supposed to mean? What the fuck? <laughs> Bro, what, what are you gathering information on? Do you want to know our blood pressure, too? Do you want to know... <laughs> Are you gonna, like, take my fucking stem cell count? Are you gonna take my, like, uh, my red blood cell count? Are you working with the IRS? I feel like they're working in, like, organ trafficking or something. Updating the, the VTuber wiki. <laughs> Oh, my social security number? Yeah, sir. Uh, I can tell you. Please, please steal my identity. I would love that. Okay. I need... Crispy cereal, coffee, chocolate. Shit, bro. I think I just need to buy everything. I might as well just stock up on literally everything as much as I can. And then put the rest in storage. 
there's no fucking way I'm gonna remember everything. When was my last beaten count? A couple years ago, actually. I'm due for another another test. I wonder if my my thetan numbers are improving. Mm. What's your cancel till I need it for the cloning process? Uh, it's a uh, neutral. <laughs> oh fuck. Okay. Should I just expand it right now? Oh no, I have to repay some of my loans. Let's just expand. What is the circumference of my nostril? Which one? Left or right? Does Aethel come with that identity? No, no! No! Fuck no! Are you deer pretty or fox pretty? I'm a... Like a... Naked mole rat. I'm just... I'm not deer pretty or fox pretty. I'm just the... Uh, I'm like a... An animal you find in the woods that clearly has something wrong with it. Like it, it's got something wrong with its brain and it's probably gonna die soon. And you want to stay really far away from it. <laughs> I'm like one of those deers that has the brain worms. That just like activate randomly. And it just starts like walking around foaming at the mouth going... <laughs> Yeah, I'm like a diseased, fucked up, uh, woodland creature. Oh, fuck. Um... Growth. Wait, we don't have enough for a growth of our store. But... We will after this day. God damn. Okay. I'm just gonna buy up literally everything. Like this. Nine, ten. And then for some reason you can only buy a max of ten things. So I'm gonna go like eh eh. Eh eh eh. Eh eh eh. Eh eh. eh, eh. eh. And I got the soda. And then... Eh. We have enough of that soda. I know. We have dead. We have dead. And then we have enough yogurt. We don't need that. We need this though. Oh, we need this though. Oh, we might need more toilet paper. Toilet paper. Toilet paper. Oh, we do not need cheese mozzarella. Fuck that. No, get the fuck out of my cart. Cheese parmesan. More of the sugar. More of the cereal. Ah, uh, french fries. More potatoes. Holy shit. Are you guys ready to see this shipment that just came in? Oh, fuck yeah. Rawr. Look at all this shit, bro. It's so satisfying. I'm telling you guys, this game... There's something dark-sided about this fucking game. I can't stop playing it and I can't stop thinking about it. It has a fucking chokehold over me. And you know what I do when I'm not playing it? I watch other people play it. There's like uh, f 10 different VTubers and streamers who play this game too. And if I see that they're playing it, I'm like, oh my god, I have to, I have to fucking watch. I have to get intel on how their store is running. Hmm, I see. I see. That's how they have their shelves stocked. Hmm. Hmm, interesting. And I just zone out for hours and hours and hours. I don't know what it is. It's like... It scratches that like tiz part of my brain where... I just see number go up and you like automate shit with the, the employees. It just feels so good. It's the ultimate Adderall game. Okay, now I'm gonna get the toilet paper nice and healthily stocked. That looks like shit, so I'm gonna go like that. Uh, wait, that looks like extra shit. Put that right there and that right there. Does that look okay or does it look stupid? If you came into the store, would you look at the shelves and like... Scoff at them? Like... <laughs> Looks like... Yes! I'll put the french fries right here. Mmm! Everybody's gonna be so happy! 
Yay! They restocked the French fries! Woohoo! Yay! Uh... What did I... I don't remember where I stocked the cereal last. I think I just put it... Uh... Right here. That looks good, right? Looks nice. Wait, for real? So wait, if you came into the supermarket... Would you look around with like wonder and like awe in your eyes like a like a kid in a candy store? Would you make like anime girl noises when you come in like Wow oh, so And have like uh like shiny crystals in your eyes? <laughs> what if the health inspector was an anime girl? And she came in, like, sniffing the floor on all fours, trying to find all the, the rat droppings. Boy, howdy. I want to go to anime heaven. You know how all dogs go to heaven? Do you think all anime girls go to, like, anime girl heaven? Okay, it's a little strange that I put potatoes next to the honeybee's cereal. But, you know, it's part of psychology. There's a there's a whole psychology to the layout of a store. You come in and instantly your attention is drawn to all these sweet snacks like oh no I shouldn't I really shouldn't I'm on a diet but but oh maybe I'll start my diet tomorrow and then you pull off one of these maybe one or two or three or maybe some of these maybe some uh, powdered sugar straight from the teat straight from the tap Oh here's some milky we always keep the milk nice and cold, fully stocked. Oh fuck, you know what I forgot to get? I forgot to get the... The unrefrigerated milky. I'm such a fucking idiot! Ugh. What if the devil was an anime girl? I mean, she is. Isn't she? <laughs> Are you guys implying that Iron Mouse doesn't have full control over hell? Are you trying to start a fucking uprising, huh? Okay, there's the the unrefrigerated milky. Trying to usurp the throne. Oh fuck! I have too much flour. You know what? Oh god! I still <laughs> no! I forgot I had this box of other flour. Ah! Here, let me put on some some chill ass music. I've been trying the Spotify D DJ thing, and it's actually been pretty nice. I like when he when he talks to me. Kind of like he's like easing me into whatever money he's gonna what, money whatever music he's gonna put on. Young money. Just kind of like making me less scared, like he's comforting a scared horse. Let's see. Ah, uh, I spice. Thank you, the shit. Fart. <coughs> Wait, have you guys tried on mobile? I don't know if they have this on desktop. There's a Spotify fortune teller now. And you can ask it any question, and it'll answer it with a, a song. The other night, I was driving April to the gym, and I asked it, um... Is my pet happy? And it started playing, uh... A Black Eyed Peas song. Wait, no! It played One More Time by Daft Punk. One more time. Which maybe means that, uh, Kino... ...wants to go on more walkies. I look like a camel, I got a hump. I stole water in my big fat hump. I'm walking in the desert. I'm a one pump chomp. <laughs> Gra. <laughs> like. <laughs> Please give me your blessing. Wait, are you getting married to someone? Like, are you asking me as if I'm like the father of the the bride? Sure, bro. You can marry my daughter. But, uh, I want a cut. I want a cut of the... my daughter's money. When... when she dies. 
I'm gonna be holding you to that, okay? Contractually. If something... If my daughter mysteriously dies... I want a cut. What's in it for me? How can you sweeten the pot? I wonder if they have... Do they have it on desktop? I've been so curious. Like, I want to ask it another question. I want to ask it... <laughs> if I'm going to be able to beat Elden Ring before the DLC comes out. Or if I'm going to make a giant fool of myself and everyone's going to laugh at me. You know what? If I don't beat it before the DLC comes out... Which is highly likely. I... I invite everyone to literally circle around me and point and laugh. And, uh... I mean, it's a good me. thing there's no crime in this city. There's just a bunch of boxes full of shit in the streets in that open room <laughs> next door. Bro, and there's always cars that run over them. So I just imagine like everything on my shelves has tire marks embedded in it and smells like motor oil. It's all, it's all part of the experience. Like people don't come to Myanmar expecting quality. Like, do you guys come to watch the stream expecting a quality stream? No. You come here to watch a middle-aged woman lose her mind and g make gurgling noises. You come to see, like, you're uh, rubbernecking a traffic accident. You can, like, kind of see, like, the wreckage, and you see some, like, red juice leaking out of the car, and it's like, is that blood or is it, uh, motor oil? I don't know. Oh, jeez, do I want to look? Or, oh, I'll take a, just a little peek. Just a little bit of a peek. And then you look, and uh, everyone's actually fine, and you're like, phew! But, like, part of you is just, like, your heart is racing, and you're thinking, like, man, I could have seen a dead pe person today. On my morning commute, I could have seen a, a dead person. I could have seen a mangled dead corpse laid out on the asphalt today. Wow. Life is so short and so fickle. Could end in an instant, huh? No more dead bodies. No more dead bodies. If it's red, it's probably transmission fluid. Oh, they had their period, and that's why they got in a car crash. They just got too mad. That's why women shouldn't drive, because sometimes they have that time of the month, and they're like, they get extra bad roadways, and they crash it. Ah! Um, uh, to need any more eggs, anyone? <laughs> Not me. Damn. All right, I'm fully stocked. I think... I think we're good. Wait, what are we missing? I feel like we're missing something. There is a shelf down here that had something on it. Was it just more of this milky? More milky. More milky and more zap soda. Freshly ran over eggs. Yes. <laughs> It's got all the, the motor oil and gasoline mixed up with the yolk. Extra protein. Who could complain? Black tea? I think we, we fully have black tea. What about butter? Mm -mm, butter! Oh, butter! God! Wait, do I have butter? Did I put it somewhere in here? Um, guys, who ate all the sticks of butter? Fess up. I know you guys ate the entire stick of butter. I don't like butter. Then what's that butter-shaped indent bulging out of your stomach, huh? Why is there a gigantic rectangular prism shape bulging out of your stomach if you didn't eat the butter, huh? Fucking liar. Uh, what was I gonna get again? Uh, soda. Zap soda. And... More milky. Bountiful in the... Uh-huh, honey. Okay. Where's the soda? 
There it is. Okay. I'm gonna restock these. We're gonna run the store and then we'll switch to Elden Ring. I just want to see how much profits I can maximize. <laughs> I'm going to get everyone in this city addicted to sugary goodness. They're gonna become my little sugary slaves. <laughs> Come, little children. Come into my store. Come sample my treats. Are you ready for more? Come to my store. On the shelf you will find many treats and sweets. Their taste is divine. Oh, businessman, I see you want pasta. But would you want sugary soda to last you? Are you going to check out or perhaps you'd like more? Thank you for visiting my sugary store. Your complexion looks leathery. Your eyes look dead. Perhaps you need some sugary thoughts in your head. I see you are balding. And your shirt is unironed. I want to set this entire building on fire. I see you want a little box of cake and some chocolate. You got a bow tie and the and the, and the body to match it. Ooh, camouflage shorts. It's like I can't even see you grabbing some tea and maybe some teepee too. You're going to need it, bro. You're going to need that teepee. You're going to need it, bro. Some frozen fries to bake at night. And then some sugar to wash away your fright. It's part of the store experience. They send in an, uh... Just like a, a strange witch-like woman to follow, just like closely hover around every single customer. What would you like to buy, my good sir? May I interest you in some more sugar? Perhaps some flour will suit your fancy. Or maybe something security, the sugary produce, and sweet. The customers again. So like, yeah, it's basically like Walmart. Oh fuck, there's people needing to be checked out. I forgot. Ooh. Would you like some change? My good sir? Thank you for purchasing all my sugar. 102 on the card. Have a nice day. That pizza won't make your pain go away. Try to eat my delicious treats. To forget all your fears. Come to my store. There are many dreams here. Oh. Everyone is just like... Buying the weirdest combinations of shit. Like, who just buys a package of shredded cheese and two Diet Cokes? Lady looks depressed as fuck. Me? Literally me? The voice you're making sounds like they're exchanging their souls for food. Everyone who enters into the store, they make a pact. As soon as they go through the door. Welcome to my supermarket. My evil, <laughs> evil. supermarket. You want all the sugar. Yes, yes. get fat and plump and yes. ripe. Yes. Uh, 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 uh. You all eat my sugary treats and get plump. And then I shall line you up and pound your rumps. <laughs> I'm going to get all my customers fat. I'm going to fill them with sugars. 
until they get cavities, and then I'm going to drill their cavities, but not the ones in their mouths. Yes, yes, eat all the sugary treats and rot out your teeth. Buy lots of things. Would you like a receipt? Oh, I see you want yogurt. Feeling a little healthy, I see. But perhaps may I interest you into something more sweet? Don't worry about your diet. If you see a sugary treat, then buy it. I won't bite. Pretty soon, all my customers are going to be walking out of the store looking satisfied and looking like queens. Everyone is going to walk out of the store with uh, BBLs, just bouncing with glee. Ten cents, I see. Uh, three dollars. You really expect me to add all that shit up? Fuck you. Wait, I'm selling a product without setting its price? What? Ah, the cereal! No, I'm losing so much money on this. No. Wait, I'm out of coffee too. Coffee and sugar. To whet your appetite. Going to make you nice and fat. Make it grip extra tight. <laughs> Holy fuck, bro. That's a good haul of groceries right there. I'm not judging. <laughs> Buy some sweets after a long day on the job. That pussy gonna boil my dick like a 7-Eleven hot dog. I see you're perusing the refrigerated shelves. Perhaps may I interest you into my little elves? And then I open a really small door right here and a bunch of elves come in and start like sniffing everyone's toes. God, it's dark in here. It's dark in here, huh? Yeah, have, have you looked around and noticed how dark it is in here? Now imagine that your entire world is like that. Imagine just walking around in the dark all the time. And how that feels. Ooh. Business casual, no blazer, just the tie. Buying some sweets. Watching your life go by. I want to watch the light leave everyone's eyes. Every customer who comes into my store has a story. I follow them around. I keep notes of their glory. Waiting for checkout. Buying lots of items, I see. Having a little sugary parley. Is there room for me? Room for one more? I love this Elden Ring gameplay. Yeah, it's so fucking good. I'm making so much good progress. I'm beating so many bosses. Restocking the flower? Wait, we're out of red flower! People love the red flower. Oh no, I'm letting them down. Fuck, guys, why didn't you tell me? No, everyone's gonna be mad at me. All my customers are gonna be so upset. Every day at the checkout counter, I daydream about the customers murdering me in cold blood. I just like space out while like I'm like typing in the like trying to calculate their change and I just zone out and imagine them just stabbing me repeatedly and licking the blood off the knife. Ooh, we need more sugar salt. Wait, what am I doing? I can't. I, oh god, I'm getting sucked in. Guys, this is what happens when I load up this fucking game. No. My favorite part about this game is that you own the store and you don't make the profits by exploiting the employees super mm -hmm. cool to see you own your means of production. Yes. I mean, this guy, he doesn't...
doesn't need to be paid. He's just happy to be here and help out, right? He he doesn't speak. He isn't actually not allowed to speak or really do anything aside from uh, working here. But I I think he's happy. One must imagine that he is happy. Hmm. Come out, my elves, and restock the shelves. Open up your cheeks into that asshole I will delve. Come out, come out, my little fuck elves. Okay, I have to play Elden Ring this. Wait, let me... Okay. Do you guys want to see what it looks like when I expand it? Check this shit out. Yeah! Bro, look at how much space there is back here now! Yo! Wait. Okay. I have a vision. I'll build up Elden Ring in one second, but... What do you guys think about moving the refrigerated section back here? So much room for activities! Oh no, I have the zoomies! I can't stop! Oh! Oh, there's a wide open area! I have to run around really fast in a circle in it! Oh! Yeah, this is gonna be the frozen zone. Yeah, we can put all of our boxes here. Nice! You can put so many boxes of shit back there. Yeah, bro! Yeah, and this corner can be like the little shit corner. Because we don't have a bathroom yet. So if anyone needs to relieve themselves, they can just go into the corner over here. Maybe I'll put like a privacy screen. Yeah, that would be so nice. But for real, do you think like... <clears throat> I'm thinking... Maybe I should move refrigerator section back here. Either that or... Move the shelves so that they're facing the other way. And have more like regular shelves back here. I don't know. I'm gonna have to really think about it, but I'll give you guys another update next stream. Anyway. Save. Let's boot up Elden Ring. <laughs>